¿Qué era lo que salía? ¿Cómo se me 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 the Google Suite. So we already use the Microsoft Suite. So now we're going to use the Google Suite, okay? Okay. So how was the, the way to log into the class? Was it easy or difficult, Castani? Uh, can you repeat, please? Yes. How was the process to log in the class? Easy or difficult? Uh, easy. Easy. Just with any Gmail, right? Uh, I don't uh, enter with my account. Ah, okay, okay, okay. You just it actually for your name and that was all? Yes. Very good. Perfect. Yes, that is the idea to make it for the student easy to access the class. Good, Casali, good. Okay, so Casali, please tell me, Casali, how was your weekend? Uh, it was fine. Fine, good, Casali. What do you do? Uh, I studied a lot. Okay, you said a lot. Why, Casali, for your thesis or for your programming course? Mm, yes, for both of them. Very good, Casali. Good, Casali. Okay, so, and then, Casali, what is it you do? Do you have a time, you have some time to watch TV, to read a book, something like that? Mm, not really. I just uh, bake a uh, um, sweet uh, corn. Oh, the list is really good. Sorry. And tell me, Kasali, what was it like? Mm, it was good. good. <laughs> Excellent, Kasali. Very good. Oh, yes, and tell me, Kasali, what was the weather like there last weekend? Mm -hmm. It was warm, okay. but Mm, it rained. It rained a lot, or it a little. Rained. A it lot rained. Of... Okay, mm. okay. Good, Casali. Very good, Casali. Very good. Oh, okay, Casali. So let, let's continue with the new unit. I'm going to share the book with you. Okay, look at this. And look at this. I'm going to share the book. Okay, so it's there. So let me let me share it with you. Okay. Say, can you see the book? Yes. Very good. So we're going to start Casali Unit 9, which is Tech Savvy. What do you think, Casali? How do you say Tech Savvy in Spanish, Casali? Tech Savvy. Um, ayuda Tecnológica or something like that? Exactly. Ayuda Tecnológica. Very good. Okay. Okay, Casali. So let's start. Here says Lesson A, Tech Support. This is lesson 1B. It says, what problems are the people about having? What do their friends suggest? Okay, sorry. I'm going to play the recording and please Kasali, tell me if you listen to it, okay? Okay. Okay. There it goes. Page 86, unit 9. It sounds... Uh, mm -hmm. Yes. Bajito, I don't remember the uh, word. It, it sounds low. low. Uh, it sounds low. Yes. Okay, okay so yeah, I'm going to wait a minute. I'm going to increase the volume. Okay, there it goes. It's there. Okay. Is it there? Okay. Okay. So it should be there. Okay. Okay, so there it goes. Okay. Very good. Yes. Page 86, Unit 9, Tech Savvy, Lesson A, Tech Support, 1, Getting Started, B, Listen, What Problems Are the People Above Having? What Do Their Friends Suggest? 1, My computer won't turn on. Do you know what the problem is? I wonder if there's something wrong with your power cord. Mine did that, and I called tech support, but I can't remember what they said. Two. There's something wrong with my tablet. It keeps freezing up. 
I have no idea why it's doing that. Do you know if the battery's charged? I wonder if you have a virus. Try running your antivirus software. Three. I don't know what the problem is, but I can't print anything. The last time that happened to me, I got the answer on a website, but I have no idea which site I used. Four. I can't get on the internet. Do you know what I should do? I wonder if you accidentally turned off the wireless connection. Let me see. How is it? How was the sound? It sounds uh, a little low, but it's enough, I think. Okay, very good. Okay. Honestly, let, let, let's practice. Okay, I am I am Sean and you are Malak. Okay, it says, my computer won't turn on. Okay, do you know what the problem is? I wonder if there's something wrong with your power cord. Mind it that and I call the support, but I can't remember what they said. I am Pam, you are Sally, and I am Peter. It says, there's something wrong with my tablet. It keeps freezing up. I have no idea why it's doing that. Do you know if the battery is char charged? Charged? Good. I wonder if you have a virus. Try running your antivirus software. Good to Sally. Okay, you are Olivia, I am Tom. I don't know what the problem is, but I can't print anything. The last time that happened to me, I got the answer on a website, but I have no idea which site I used. I, I am Kara. I can get on the internet. Do you know what should I, what I should do? I wonder if you accidentally turned on the wireless connection. Let me see. Very good, Sally, very good. So, okay, I'm going to take this to to the board, okay, wait a minute, very good. Okay, there. Okay. Okay, he's there. Okay, Sally, can you see the board? Mm -hmm. In the phone card? Yes. Ah, okay, but okay, let me, let me. I'm going to share it again. Okay, there it goes. Oh, uh, no, it's okay, but I'm. Ah, yes. Waiting for. Okay, okay, very good. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so, so let's practice this. It says, How do the people say the things below in one sentence? Write what they usually say, then compare with a the partner. For example, Sean. What is the problem? Do you know? Sally, is the battery charged? Do you know? Tom, which side did I use? I have no idea. Anita, did you accidentally turn the wireless connection off? I wonder. For example, here I we have two questions. Let's make two questions into one very formal question. Look at this, for example, you start with, with this, okay? You start with, ah, but it's very smooth. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, to copy from here. Wait a minute. Okay. Here again. For example, you say, do you know? We start like this, okay? Do you know? Do you know what the problem is? Look at the order that's here. Do you know what the problem is? The original question is, what is the problem? But here, Kesali, we put the, the verb to be at the end of the sentence. Why? Because we are making two questions into one. This question, Kesali, is very formal. Okay. okay. okay so you, you please change the others. Wait a minute. You okay. start with, do you know?
Very good. I want if I want if you accidentally very good. All right, guys. I will read the first okay, and you read the, the correct option. Okay, it says, What is the problem? Do you know? Do you know what the problem is? Good. Is the battery charged? Do you know? Do you know if the battery is charged? Good. Which side did I use? I have no idea. I have no idea which side i used good did you accidentally turn the wireless connection off i wonder i wonder if you accidentally turned the wireless connection off very good okay, okay. okay. all right guys. so here Gassali, it's let's learn Gassali, some tech phrasal verbs okay for example i will read plug in this is to connect a device to a power source or network log on log in to access a computer system or online account, shut down to turn off a computer or device, restart reboot to restart a computer or device, backup to make a copy of data for safekeeping, troubleshoot to identify and resolve issues with a computer or device. Because Ali, follow up, please. Follow up to check on the status of a reported issue or ticket. Very good. Set up to configure a new computer device or software. Good. Uh, power on, power up to turn on a computer or device. Good. Upgrade to install a newer version of software or hardware. Good. Uh, unplug to disconnect a device from a power source or network. Okay. Scroll down, scroll up to move the visible area of a computer screen up or down. Oh, I guess, I guess, you please copy, because I only plug in, log on, log in. Okay, don't copy the, the meaning, just copy the phrase over, okay? Okay. I will tell you that in Spanish, okay? Very good. Okay. Very good.
Don't teacher. Verga, Sani. Okay. Let's, for example, plug in. Tengo que hacer super easy, plug in, conectar. Ok, I'm going to check it again. Plug okay. in, conectar. Log in on o log in, ok, es acceder, acceder, ok, shut down, shut down, apagar, yes, restart, reboot, eso es reiniciar, yes, backup. Back a veces, también en español lo usamos, es hacer una copia de seguridad. Okay. Yes. Troubleshoot, troubleshoot, encontrar problemas, identificar problemas con la computadora. Oh. Troubleshoot, buscar problemas, identificar problemas. En mm, Windows es... Uh, uh, mi resolvedor de, de problemas o algo así. Exacto, ese. Tan natal, está bien, se nos acuerda que Beriut, sí, sí. Beriut, Beriut. Follow up. Follow up es um, hacer acompañamiento, dar un seguimiento. Follow up. Ok. Setup. Setup es uh, configurar. Ok. Power on, power up, es de, son de ya de seis, son lo mismo. Eso es encender un equipo, encender una computadora. Okay. Upgrade. Okay. Mejorar. O actualizar. Yes. Unplug. Desconectar. Yes. Scroll down, scroll up, scroll down es ir hacia abajo. Ok. Yes. And scroll up, ir hacia arriba, ¿no? En una pantalla, por ejemplo, ¿no? Ok. Very good. Excellent, very good, ok. So, let's continue with the book. Ok. Ok, and I'm going to take this to the board, ok, with a minute. Ok. Obviously. So it's here, okay? Here we can it says question within sentences. For example, it says, the question, what is the problem? Question within question is, do you know what the problem is? Or question with the statements, I don't know what the problem is. So we have two possibilities to make to make direct questions, to make questions within questions, and to make questions within statements or sentences, for example. Which site do you, you use? Can you remember which site you use? I have no idea which site I use. What should we do? Do you know what we should do? I know what we should do. Why is it doing that? Do you have any idea why it's doing that? I have no idea why it's doing that. Is the battery charged? Do you know if the battery is charged? I wonder if the battery is charged. All of these have a, a WS question, what, which, why. So we use that as a connector, okay? To ask them into, into a question or to ask them into a, a statement. 
if we have no wh <clears throat> like is or do or are or will or would okay we use the connector if when we don't have a wh question at the beginning okay, okay. Yes. Well, yeah. what is the problem it says do you know what the problem is here the connector well the, the, the variable goes at the end okay you said don't, don't use question word order for a question with the question for a statement i know what you can do do you know what you need never i know what can you do no do you know what do you need to do no yes do you know what you need to do i know what you can do why because it's an engaging okay putting together two questions okay into one or a question into a very formal sentence okay Always, we can we need we need a starter. Like for example, do you know? Can you remember? Do you have an idea? Do you know? Do you happen to know? Okay. Do you happen to know? De casualidad, sabes? Do you happen to know? Okay. Or when enunciado, for example, I don't know. I have no idea. I know, I have no idea, I wonder. Okay. So ponemos una más que también es muy común, que es esta. I would like to know. Okay. I would like to know. Me gustaría saber. Okay. Okay, sorry. For example, it says rewrite these sentences. Start with expressions given. Are there any useful new apps for students? Do you know? Do you know if there are any useful new apps for students? What are the most popular sites for streaming movies? I wonder. Which song did you, did you last download? Can you remember? Where can I get some cool accessories for a tablet? Do you know? What is the most popular smartphone? Do you know? How do you design your own website? Do you have an idea? Will the price of tablets come down? I wonder. What the new, what new technology is coming out? Do you have an idea? Oh, yes, would you please rewrite them here, please? Okay. Good. Very good, very good.
Don Teacher. Excelente, excelente, very good. Okay, so let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let me share the screen with you. Very good. Okay. This, I wonder, this is, what are the most popular sites for streaming movies? I wonder what, I remember what the most popular sites for the streaming movies are. Remember, the verb has to be at the end, okay? Oh, yes. Okay. Can you remember which song you last downloaded? Very good. Do you know where, 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 where I can get, do you know where I, like it says, where can I get, do you know where I can get some cool accessories for a tablet? Okay. Do you know what? The most, listen, what the most popular smartphone is? Okay, do you know what the most popular smartphone is? Do you have any idea how you, how you design your own website? Okay. I wonder if the prices of tablets will will come down do you have any idea what what the new technology what new technology is coming out do you have any idea what new technology is coming out Please, after after the, the the starter you need a connector and then the rest of the center Casali, is like a normal sentence like a subject, verb, and complement. Subject, verb, and complement, okay? Okay. okay let's practice a bit more, okay? Here we have also from the book. Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna make it smaller. Okay. This one, okay. Very good. For example, it says on scramble the questions and complete the answers with your own information. For example, number one, you know has your computer do how much memory? The order is, do you, do you know how much memory your computer has? How many hours do you online each week spend? You have an idea? A lot. I don't know exactly. I don't know exactly. You know, do is a good wireless internet connection in your classroom there if, well, I don't know. Every week, you know, do how many text messages you sent? Not really, I don't really know. You remember sent can who you emailed to yesterday? Yes, I can remember exactly. For example, how many hours do you online each week spend? Do you have any idea? We start like this. Do you, do you have? Okay. Do you have any idea? Okay. It's more. Do you have any idea? Okay. How many hours? Okay. You spent online each week do you have an idea how many hours you spend online each week oh yes very good remember this is the connector okay how many hours and then you have the subject you have the verb and you have the complement okay okay very good, very good, very good.
Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good sign. Okay, sign. Now please answer the question. Okay, for example, do you know how much memory your computer has? No, actually, I can't remember. And then you have to say, no puedo recordar cuánta memoria mi computadora tiene. Okay. Very good. Very good. Good, 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 good. Very good.
Excellent. Good, 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 good. Very good, Sarah. Okay, so I will read the question and you tell me the answer. It says, do you know how many, how much memory your computer has? No, actually, I can remember how much memory my computer has. Do, okay, do you have, do you have any idea how many hours you spend online each week? Hey, a lot. I don't know exactly how much how many hours I spend online each, each week? Very good. Do you know if there is a good wireless internet connection in your classroom? Uh, well, I don't know if there's a good internet connection in my classroom. Do you know how many text messages you send every week? Not really. I don't really know how many text messages I send every week. Can you remember who you sent emails to yesterday? Yes, I can remember exactly who I sent emails to yesterday. Excellent, excellent. very good. Yes, I said, speaking and listening, what do you know about the internet? It says, very work. Discuss the questions. Can you guess the answers? Then listen to conversation about the internet. Write the answer you hear. For example, do you know when the public first used the World Wide Web? Two, can you find out what the first webcam filmed? Three, do you know what the most popular online activities are? Question number four, can you guess? Can you guess how many new blogs people add to the internet each day? Good. Do you know what the first email spam adverse decide? Ad advertise. 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 Very good. Six. Do you know what the three most common languages on the internet are? Very good, Sally. Okay, so let me share again. Okay, and let's listen to that. Very good. Okay, wait, wait a minute. Very good. There it goes. Okay. We know. Yes. Um, let me see. Where is the book? It is the book. Yes. Okay. Okay, there. Page 87. Three. Speaking and listening. What do you know about the internet? A and B. Listen to a conversation about the internet. I have a computer technology assignment and I have absolutely no idea what the answers to these questions are. I mean, do you know when the public first used the World Wide Web? Um, no, but I have my computer here. We can check it out. Oh, okay. Do you mind? Sure. Let me turn it on. Okay. So what was that first question? Um, do you know when the public first used the World Wide Web? Okay. It looks like, um, oh, 1991. August 6th, 1991. That's when people first used the internet. It actually started back in the 1960s, though. Okay, so what's your next question? Can you find out what the first webcam filmed? Let's see. Oh, it was filming a coffee pot at the University of Cambridge, so people could see on their computers when the coffee pot was full. Really? That's hilarious. All right, next. Do you know what the most popular online activities are? One has to be shopping, right? Well, that and banking, maybe. Huh, interesting. It says online banking, then shopping, and then searching for jobs. It says 60% of people in 24 countries use the internet for online banking. 
Well, at least I got one kind of right. Okay. What else? Can you guess how many new blogs people add to the internet each day? Oh, that's going to be a lot. 50,000? No, more than 175,000. Wow. Many of them are personal blogs and news blogs, it says. Okay, next one. Do you know what the first email spam advertised? Um, I bet it was jeans. Or wait, well... I guessed vacations. No, it advertised a computer. Though it says now it's mainly medications. Okay, final question. Do you know what the three most common languages on the internet are? I'm guessing English for sure. And, um... English, Chinese, and Spanish. Okay. English represents more than 43% of the internet. Perfect. Thanks. No problem. It's easy when you can look everything up online. Yeah. Oh, but wait. Shoot. It says here that I have to look the information up again from another source. Oh, no. I have to do it all again? Okay, listen again and this time wait then, okay? Okay. Minute. Page 87. Three. Speaking and listening. What do you know about the internet? A and B. Listen to a conversation about the internet. I have a computer technology assignment, and I have absolutely no idea what the answers to these questions are. I mean, do you know when the public first used the World Wide Web? Um, no. But I have my computer here. We can check it out. Oh, okay. Do you mind? Sure. Let me turn it on. Okay. So what was that first question? Um, do you know when the public first used the World Wide Web? Okay. It looks like, um, oh, 1991. August 6th, 1991. That's when people first used the Internet. It actually started back in the 1960s, though. Okay, so what's your next question? Can you find out what the first webcam filmed? Let's see. Oh, it was filming a coffee pot at the University of Cambridge, so people could see on their computers when the coffee pot was full. Really? That's hilarious. All right, next. Do you know what the most popular online activities are? One has to be shopping, right? Well, that and banking, maybe. Huh. Interesting. It says online banking, then shopping, and then searching for jobs. It says 60% of people in 24 countries use the Internet for online banking. Well, at least I got one kind of right. Okay. What else? Can you guess how many new blogs people add to the internet each day? Oh, that's going to be a lot. 50,000? No, more than 175,000. Wow. Many of them are personal blogs and news blogs, it says. Okay, next one. Do you know what the first email spam advertised? Um, I bet it was jeans. Or wait, well... I guessed vacations. No, it advertised a computer. Though it says now it's mainly medications. Okay, final question. Do you know what the three most common languages on the internet are? I'm guessing English for sure. And, um... English, Chinese, and Spanish. Okay. English represents more than 43% of the Internet. Perfect. Thanks. No problem. It's easy when you can look everything up online. Yeah. Oh, but wait. Shoot. It says here that I have to look the information up again from another source. Oh, no. I have to do it all again?
Excellent, Gasari. Very good. Very good. Okay. 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 It says, um, do you know when the public face use the World Wide Web? Uh, 1991, August 6th. Very good. August 6th, 1981. Yeah. Very good. Okay. Can you find out what the first webcam filmed? Uh, a coffee pot. Yes, exactly. A coffee pot. Very good. Yes, the way to the cafeteria. No? Good. Yes. Do you know what the most popular online activities are? Uh, banking shopping and searching for job very good can you guess how many new blogs people add to the internet each day i i can get it but i think i heard very good it's more than 100 okay almost more than more than 100 How do you read this figure, Kesani? More than... 117. Very good. Thousand. Very good. Thousand. More than 117,000. Okay. Very good. Okay. Yes. Do you know what the first email spam advertise? A, a computer. A computer. Good. Do you know what the three most common languages on the internet are? A, English. Very good. Yes. English, English, Chinese, and Spanish. Exactly, Kesari. Very good. Good, Kesari. Okay, so before we say, let's practice some conversation, Kesari. Okay, so Kesari, please tell me, what are you going to do after class, Kesari? Mm, I'm going to take a break. <laughs> okay, okay. And then I took a shower. I I'm I going know. to take a shower, yes. Very good. I'm going to take a shower. Very good. Okay. Kesali, um, I didn't ask you, what did you have for lunch today? Uh, I ate good. Uh, some, uh, how do you say rajas in English? Uh, okay. Chili chops. Chili chops. Some chili, chili chops. chops. Okay. With potato and uh, beans. Oh, delicious, Did you cook that, Kasali, or did your mother cook that for you? Uh, my brother cooked. Oh, really? Wow. So, yes. so, does he know how to cook? Can you repeat, please? Does he know how to cook? Yes. <laughs> yes. Very good, Kasali. That, that, that's a good skill, Kasali, okay? To learn how to cook. Excellent, Kasari. Kasari, uh, and what about, um, okay, so today you're going to rest for some time, then you're going to take a shower, and later, Kasari, what are you going to do? Mm. I don't know. I maybe mm. I'll uh... I'll probably. Uh, Very good. I will probably. Good, Kasali. I will probably. I will probably. Uh, um, I don't know. Uh, write uh, a little about my thesis or my pendings for tomorrow. Okay. Very good. Do you do you write a diary? Ah uh, no. No. Why don't you say you don't like to write diaries, or you have never tried uh, writing a diary? Mm, I don't have the patience to write a diary. Very good, Sally. Good, excellent, good, Sally. Good, good. Oh, I guess I some work on your thesis, Sally. And and guess, Sally, um, are you planning to present your thesis next year or this year? Hmm. I want to present it uh, this year. Okay, by December? Mm, no, I have the limit to November, so. Ah, so the, the deadline is November? Yes. Okay. And what happened if for any reason you, you don't present your thesis uh, or, you, or you don't defend your thesis in November? Mm, 
Mm, I have the option to ask for a, how do you say, prorroga? Ah, to ask for an extension? Uh, for an extension Very good. Uh, for six months. So I have six months. Ah, more. Six, six more months. Okay. Yes. Okay, okay. Oh, tell something good because I mean, and, and aren't, there, aren't there any consequences for that? I think no. It's just because um, we just have uh, one year, but. Uh, well, it's not the first option for more the students in my school. Ah, okay. So there are other options to get your degree? Yes, the, um, easy options like a, um, approved with aid or a okay. general exam, etc. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So writing the, this is, is one of them, not, not the only one. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, good, good, good. That's good, Casali. Okay, Casali, so that's good for today, Thank you very much, Casali. See you tomorrow. Take care. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Thank you. Thank you.